Why does your book need to exist when there's already so many books in your genre already written? For example, with Bushra's book, there's like 60,000 competing titles in the marketing and sales categories, but there hadn't been one written yet that took the psychology of persuasion and online business and brought them together in an easy to understand, instantly applicable, um, high converting focus type of a book. So we made sure that the topic of the book was, I guess, well, like I said, mass market, but it appealed to enough people so they got circulation in the market and that Amazon is organically marketing the book for her. And that way, when people are reading about the book itself, then they go, wow, this is absolutely incredible. Look at all the things that I can learn from this one book. This is going to be useful for me for years to come. Connect your ideas your methodology to the unsolved challenges or unfulfilled needs that they're currently facing. For example, uh, I have a client in South Africa whose readership are um, aspiring marketers, right? And so what we're doing is we're connecting um, his world of basically aspiring marketers and what they want for their careers to exactly what he has to offer them. So the book is a natural fit. People are browsing the page on Amazon and think, wow, I feel like this book was written for me. Bingo. You don't write a textbook. You write a story that is easy to read. You offer a narrative that's very free-flowing. There's not too much technical information, but it's, it's eye-catching. And there's enough headlines and subheadlines throughout the book that it's easy to read through, and it compels them to keep reading further. Throughout your book, make darn sure you take a wrecking ball to all of the BS, the myths, the lies, the advice that doesn't work that your readers have been getting from everybody else. Maybe even the go-to experts that be, and you know that your book can knock those people off of the industry throne.